Hey everyone, I'm back again, this time to state my opinion on Call of Duty Wii and the Wii system itself. Now, since I only have two Call of Duty Wiis for my system, I'm just going to give my opinion on it overall using these two games. Now, Black Ops Wii was my first Wii game that I bought with this. As you can see in my one of my other videos. And I've actually liked the series overall, but it's, it does have some flaws like hackers and campers and noob tubers. Black Ops Wii is basically um, it's either better or worse than the DS version I have up there <clears throat> compared to Modern Warfare 3. I heard in other videos that when this first came out this had lag shooting. Anytime you try and shoot someone the hit marker won't really appear and you just like find yourself dead in a split second. <coughs> Compared to Hackers, though, I'm not sure which version is worse, because I've seen it in both versions, actually. Like, here are some kill streaks that aren't even on this version of Modern Warfare 3, but people still use it, like Predator Missile and all that. And on here, there's stuff like... Um, Unlimited ammo and never die and all that. Plus, you can make it to where you can make it to prestige. Um, I don't know how many prestiges there are in this one, but you can make yourself up to maximum prestige, which I really don't like hacks, really. Nor do I like noob tubers or campers, but we all don't like them. Uh, my Call of Duty points on this one was messed up because I joined a high lobby. And the only way for me to fix it was to prestige. So, yeah, don't trust hackers or nothing. But my opinion overall, I really like the series, mainly because it gives <coughs> it gives the series a unique feel with its controls. You can play with uh, the Wii Remote or the Zapper, or you can play with the classic controllers, which I got over there. But you can only play with the classic controllers with these two games. They didn't do with the other games for some reason. It's a bummer I don't even have the other two, but eventually I'll buy them. Now, my opinion on the Wii overall, which you can see over here, if you can see that, I can't really see that because the, black, the backlight of my iPhone is off. I gotta get that repaired sometime, but my opinion on the Wii overall, it's a really good system. It does have good games, whether you like it or not. Or, no, I shouldn't say that. I believe it or not. That's what I should say. It does have some good games, whether you believe it or not. Uh, I got three games down there. Super Smash Brothers, Brawl, Ghost Squad and House of the Dead 2 and 3. And it's also got this. Anytime you have a Wii Zapper for the first time and you just don't know how to use it properly, then that's the perfect game to use it on. But it has some other good games too. Some games which are available on 360, PS3, or even PS2. Like, uh,. Resident Evil 4 Wii Edition. Or, uh, 
Mm, what's another game? Mortal Kombat Armageddon. My thumb on the mic. Uh, let's see. And it, and it's also got some retro classics too for the virtual console, such as Kirby Superstar. Super Mario World, Sonic the Hedgehog, all of those great games. They they are all on this system. I can't remember if it has Earthbound or not. Nah. But yeah. Now before I close this video for those of you having trouble getting XP or wanting to get more XP here's a little tip for you guys on Modern Warfare 3 besides completing challenges and doing weapon upgrades uh, there there is a very special way you could get double XP besides going to the prestige shop after you prestige or none of that they have this thing on Modern Warfare 3 called the Specialist Perk or Specialist Package. What it does when you get a certain number of kills, you can get a certain uh, perk like Blind Eye or Hardline or Assassin. And what it does when you get that perk you get double the amount of XP you'd normally get which is like a hundred or something and another thing too when you do that not only are you completing the specialist challenges but you're also completing the challenges you get for that perk which is another great addition so you could basically say you're getting double the amount of XP with, with what you're normally getting. More like getting two special packages with one action. Meh. But that's it for this video. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys around.